popular restaurant just celebrated owning it for 20 years now. Yeah, that's right. So uh, Joe had the chance to check out this uh, local favorite in Grand Island. So let's go ahead and head to the bunkhouse. On this edition of In the Kitchen with Joe, I'm in Grand Island at the bunkhouse where they just celebrated their 20th year in business. In her 20 years of owning the bunkhouse, Brenda Bourne gives her all for the restaurant. I love my job. Come in here every day for 20 years, love my job. Um, everybody that works here, which is a limited staff, um, we're family. With their homemade lunch specials, salads, and their most popular item, pizza, the customers keep coming back. We have a lot of loyal customers, we have a lot of repeat customers, we have four generations of families that come in here still to this day. Brenda also says owning the bunkhouse has inspired her children. One of the great things about owning the bunkhouse is just being the role model for my children. They're all business owners themselves and so that's been great. With multiple options for food, a homey atmosphere and more, the bunkhouse is definitely a must try. You will have great food. We try to be really consistent about our food. Uh, we'll have um, a really friendly atmosphere. The staff are great and um, reasonable prices. So Brenda, the food looks amazing. What have you made for me today? Let's start with this beautiful pizza in front of me. Okay, that pizza we call the Born Supreme. And the Born is the B-O-U-R-N-E, which is the spelling of my last name. And if you've heard of Born Identity, you know where that came from. It's loaded up um, with all our meats and vegetables, minus the olives that you don't like, Joe. And yeah, that's our pizza. Yeah, you got me. I don't like olives, but I do like this pizza. This is very good. And jalapeno, get that little kick to it, too. Yeah. I love it. So Absolutely. now we'll go over to this. It's a burger. I promise it's a burger, folks. There's a burger it's, in it's, there. yes. Wow, what is this? <laughs> so we call this a bypass burger. And once again, it was um, friends sitting around and that's where we came up with the name. So it's a half a pound burger and it's on an open face bun. It has our French fries on top. We have a nacho cheese on it, a homemade uh, chili sauce, onions and jalapenos. I found the burger. Yep. <laughs> and it is very, very good. Oh, and you mentioned that you use a special grill that isn't really seen around Grand Island now. Right, right. So we have an open char grill. So we call our burgers char burgers and char cheese. And if you come in here, you'll start calling them that also. Very few of those left around gives it a lot of flavor. Yeah, I definitely could taste the flavor. Both of these items are very delicious. You can get them here at the Bunk House right off the old Highway 30. Brenda, thanks for having me today. Thank you, Joe. All right, that'll do it for another edition of In the Kitchen with Joe. Oh, that looks so good. I tried that pizza tuna. It's great. So if you want to check out the bunkhouse, you can find them at West Old Highway 30 or check out their Facebook page. You're kind of tucked away in there. They are. Mm -hmm. yeah, if you have any uh, rec restaurant recommendations for Joe, make sure you feel free to message him on Twitter or Facebook, or you can email desk at ksnblocal4.com. We've been going to the bunkhouse for years. Um, we normally do takeout. We normally um, pick up their pizza and take it mm -hmm. home. Um, so we're we're fans of their pizza. And I had a piece of that born that okay. Joe because well, he brought, brought it home. Yeah. He brought home or he brought it here to the station, I should say. And uh, it was very good. Yes, and I'm I with him. Out Everything on but the olives. So I, I enjoyed it. Yeah. I missed out. In fact, I've driven by that place so many times. It's like I said, it's kind of tucked away mm -hmm. back in there. If you're not looking, you'll miss see it. See the big sign though. You'll I've see the big sign. Never been there before. I don't know. I just. I, I, I sometimes I get too comfortable in the places I go to and I've just never been there and I've always wanted to try it yeah. and this is kind of that kick in the pants to mm -hmm. maybe get me over there finally. We've been going because um, Brenda is our friend's mom so okay. my brother or my brother, my husband grew up with um, her children okay. so gotcha. yeah so, yeah it's kind of a whole full circle thing.